Talking Stick Resort. We come to see the Prophet Joseph. We tried to get on the boat. They wouldn't let us on account of I being black. So, we walked. That must be, what, seven or eight hundred miles? Yes, sir. You're watching a scene from the new movie, Jane and Emma. It's a true story of the unlikely friendship between Jane Manning and Emma Smith, women of different races, but of the same faith in 1844. It's in theaters now. And here to tell us more is director Chantal Squires. Thanks so much for talking with us today. Thanks for having me here. I appreciate it. Why don't you tell us how you got involved in this movie and this project? Well, the reason why I started this film is because I felt really strong that women's stories needed to be told. There just needs to be more stories about women, by women, for men and women. And um, so this is, these two women are incredible women of faith. They're, they're strong characters and to be able to tell a story that captures so much important truth, it was just really compelling to me, so I had to do it. Now this is based on a true story. So what was that like to you know, have that pressure of, okay, I, I've got to be accurate here in telling the story too? Mm -hmm. Well, it, it's tricky because it's first and foremost a film. And dramatic. So, and dramatic and you have to have a, a narrative arc and so that people will be engaged and watch it. And so there were a lot of um, historical truths. We did a lot of research, my writer and um, producers, we put a lot of work into finding out historical truths. So if you, if, you, if you know history and you're a history buff and you understand what's going on, you'll see it all throughout the film. But at, we also wanted to tell a, a poetic truth, really, um, about a relationship. It's, it's really about a friendship between these two women. And um, so while telling that story and making it compelling, you know, it is very important to keep accurate to history because these women are really incredible, mm -hmm. just iconic women. Um, and so, yeah, it was really important, but also, you know, we, we took some, we imagined, we imagined what the night right. could have You don't have, have everything what happened. And tell me about the, the basics of that night and the story that you're telling. So Jane Manning, she is friends with Emma Smith and Emma Smith is the wife of the prophet of the, Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints, and he's murdered. And Jane comes to be with Emma that night. So the film takes place through the night. And the stakes are high for both of them. They both have lost something because as an African-American woman, Jane wanted to receive equal blessings as all of the white members of the church, but she wasn't. And he was offering that to her. And so, by him dying, those things died with him. And so we deal with racial issues. We deal with, um, you know, faith. faith, gender issues. There's just a lot that they both deal with through the night and it gets really intense. And, you know, they're both able to be there for each other and help them survive it. What about the cast? Because I mean, they're great. They're amazing. Mm -hmm. We were so fortunate to get such a great cast. Danielle Deadweiler plays Jane. She's from Atlanta. And um, Emily Goss and Brad Smith are Emma and Joseph. They're from out of LA. And they, oh, they're just, we got so lucky to, to find people who were close enough to the actual historical characters, at least from my perspective. You know, that's very difficult to do. Mm -hmm. um, for Jane, we had a little bit less to work with historically, so we had a little more freedom. And when Danielle auditioned, I just remember writing down, I mean, she just like, gave a killer audition and I wrote. And I love looking yeah. at the background and the scenes. Before we go, what do you hope people who go to see the film, what do you hope they take away from it? I hope that there is a lot, you know, this film means a lot of different things to so many people. And I think it resonates on so many levels. There's so many things to take away from a movie about this relationship. But I also think that like, if we as just a community are able to understand how to love people who are different than us and and to empathize and walk in someone else's shoes 
That it's would be a great us, step. Right? Yeah. Absolutely. And you can meet um, the director tonight, everybody. Actually, it's um, tomorrow. Uh, I'm going to show it to you right here. You have it tomorrow at Harkins Superstition Springs. That's a luxury 25. There's tomorrow and tonight. And tonight. There's both. Yeah. That's the best part. Okay, so let me go over this again. You can meet the director tonight and see the movie. It's at Harkins Superstition Springs, Luxury 25 at 645. Then tomorrow, you can go at either 215 or 645 p.m. And you can always learn more online by going to Jane and Emma Movie. Dot com. Again, go to those special screenings. You can see the movie tonight or tomorrow at the Harkins Superstition Springs Luxury 